friends today we are going to study about haploidy and polyploidy so haploidy generally me haploidy and polyploidy are the parts of euploidy euploidy divided in two parts haploidy and polyploidy let me tell you that euploidy means change with respect to set of chromosomes and haploidy means change with respect to one set of chromosomes one set of chromosomes is haploidy polyploidy change with respect to more than one set of chromosome change with respect to more than one set of chromosome called polyploidy now polyploidy is found rarely in animals polyploidy now further differentiate into two parts autopolyploidy and allopolyploidy autoploidy autopolyploidy means means same set of chromosomes are multiplied twice or more than twice same set of chromosome will multiply twice and more than uh, twice means auto polyploidy now example we can know auto uh, triploid or auto tetraploid auto triploid means same set of chromosome multiplied twice so we get a a a individuals are sterile because homologous chromosomes is absent here so homologous chromosomes is when homologous chromosomes is absent so it does not undergo the meiotic division so there will be no gamete formation no gamete formation take place so so the individuals are sterile example sugar beet sugar beet tomato watermelon banana auto tetraploid auto tetraploid same set of chromosome multiply twice or more than twice tetraploid means four times multiplication so one two three four <coughs> now here you can see that the individuals are fertile because homologous chromosomes are present two homologous chromosomes are present so gamete formation will take place gamete formation take place and undergo meiotic division meiotic undergo meiotic division so individual become fertile example apple potato corn bosim now Artificial polyploidy is induced by colchicine. You have might you might study colchicine on your book chapter name. You you might have study about colchicine on the chapter cell cycle and cell division. So here the use of colchicine is that colchicine it is a mitotic spindle. It is a mitotic spindle which inhibit means which stop the formation of spindle fiber, but induce but increase polyploidy by doubling the number of chromosome by doubling the number of chromosome it is very important is colchicine used to double the number of chromosome now we know that polyploidy are of two type autopolyploidy and allopolyploidy autopolyploidy or autopolyploidy we have studied about autopolyploidy now we have will, we will study it about studying about allopolyploidy in allopolyploidy different set of chromosome is multiplied while in autoploidy same set of chromosomes are multiplied so there is a difference in alloploidy different set of chromosomes are multiplied take it in take an example of raphanus sativus and brassicaca oleracea raphanus sativus means radis brassica oleracea means cabbage so here the value of 2n n is, is 18 and in basic case, already see two n values eighteen. So that is we have symbol did R R and in basic case already see B B. So it undergoes division. So meiotic division. So there will be the formation of the from from this we will get R and n values equal to nine because meiotic division is called destruction division. So n is equal to nine is equal to R same as here n is equal to nine R. Uh, n is equal to 9 and which is equal to b here also undergo meiotic division so when we will cross it on f1 generation we will find r b but they are still sterile because homologous chromosomes are absent so for becoming fertile they need to be present one r here and one b also so here we know that n is equal to 9 n is equal to 9 when they fuse and f1 generation to n is equal to 18 now you will thinking where from 18 has come so n is equal to 9 and n is equal to 9 total 18 2 n is equal to 18 rb that are sterile so we have to bring its homologous chromosome so as to make it fertile so we will use 
colchicine that I have told about you earlier that it is a mitotic poison which double the number of chromosome so by using colchicine we will double the number of chromosome so 18 18 will become 36 to n is equal to 36 and capital R capital R capital B capital B become fertile because homologous chromosome is now present so gamete formation will take place so example it's example so what the, so the product that we get from both crossing is named as rabbage because it is the product of both ref refna sativus and presigasi uh, so we'll we call it at rabbage that's all about polyploidy thank you have a nice day